This video has you create a GitHub account and create a specialized repository to use as a website. GitHub is a website for storing and sharing code and maintaining version control of that code. You will need a GitHub account for the class. Signing up is identical to any other account sign up that you may have previously done online. Go to https github.com. Fill in the sign up form on the home page using a username. The username can contain no spaces, your email address, and a password. The password must have at least seven characters, one number, and one letter. Once registered, you will be asked to choose a plan. You can keep the default unlimited public repositories for free. Click Continue. You will be taken to an account settings screen where you can set your preferences for emails. GitHub will also have sent an email to you with a link to verify your email address. You will need to check your email. GitHub will have sent you an email to confirm your email address. Find the email and click the provided link. You may need to check your clutter inbox if you're using a school account. You will be returned to GitHub, probably in a new tab. You will see two buttons, Read the Guide and Start a Project. Click the Start a Project button. You will be taken to a Create a New Repository screen. In the repository name text box, type whatever your username is dot github dot io. For example, userdemo22.github.io. Click the Initialize this repository with a README checkbox. Click the Create Repository button. A repository is like a folder. It is a storage location. In the case of GitHub, a repository is where you place all of the code pertaining to a particular project or application. You can have multiple repositories in GitHub. However, you can only have one repository that has the github.io designation to use as a website. The repository that you have just created is a special kind of repository which can be used as a website. We will set up your local tool to use this repository in the next video.